Is it all over? Is this maybe the beginning of a much larger downtrend or possibly the beginning of the next bear market for crypto? I mean, guys, Bitcoin is going down, crypto is going down, just me. Everything is deeply in the red today, massive crashes in the crypto space. And if you look at news events, it's looking super ugly. I'm not gonna get into politics here on the channel, of course, but yeah, you know what I mean. So yeah, is this the moment to panic? Is this the moment to be fearful while well, everything is going lower? Are we still close to support? Is just me close to support? Can we expect a reversal back to the upside in the rest of 2024 or is it all over? These are the things that I wanna discuss in today's, uh, yeah, important video if this sounds interesting like the video of course and if you're still here if you're still holding just me then drop a japanese flag in the comments of course and lastly if you want to buy or trade crypto then use my referral links in the description of this video so guys i'm here on the daily time frame for just me and what you can see is and i already talked about this in the video from yesterday is that just me is currently testing its 200 day moving average here on the daily time frame and yes we're currently trading below it slightly but keep in mind that the daily candle didn't close just yet so there's still some time left for us to close above the 200 day moving average and to be very honest it isn't a big problem if you closed just one or two or a few daily candles below this moving average because typically price hovers around this level for some time so that is all normal in a bull market however yes the correction that we're seeing right now is pretty heavy and a lot of people are currently super fearful in the market but to give you my perspective as i said the 200 day moving average here in yellow is lining up around two cents for the just me price and the 200 day moving average works as a magnet price typically always comes back to it uh, either in an uptrend or in a downtrend we're currently in a strong uptrend still with higher highs and higher lows the market structure to be very clear is still bullish here let me also give you some potential worst case scenario support levels here for the just me price on the daily time frame and for this i'm going to sketch out a fibonacci retracement from the start of this impulse actually all the way back here to october 2023 to the high point the highest point 4.5 cents on the 7th of june yeah here we're on the logarithmic chart and you can see that the support level for just me is actually 1.6 cents which is the 0.382 fib level but if i switch over to the regular scale and i'm always switching around between these two time scales because they give you different support levels but here you can actually see that the golden ratio so the most important support level here on the daily time frame for just me is actually and let me remove the magnets magnet sorry is actually aligning here with 1.89 so let's say 1.9 cents for the just me price and as you can hear my voice i'm still a little bit under the weather here but yeah as i said the golden ratio here 1.89 to be precise if you look at the left hand side a lot of volume got transacted here in the month of march in april also in may 2024 and also recently here in the uh, beginning of july we also got a bounce from the golden ratio so in case we drop slightly lower here in the immediate short term i anticipate just me to hover around the golden pocket here around 1.89 cents for a while maybe some sideways price action before eventually a reversal back to the upside or perhaps a swift recovery immediately back to the upside for just me that is still what i'm looking out for especially since the market is already in a fearful state we're right now trading close to the 200 day moving average and we're also trading close to the golden pocket support and the previous order block where we couldn't break above the whole month of march and april so looking at the fear and greed index we can see that we're right now on 26 on the index so lower than yesterday and i think we're very close to that extreme fearful state in the market a lot of bad stuff is happening in the world right now uh, i don't want to get into politics here on the channel but yeah a lot of people are currently fearful are anticipating much lower prices for markets for crypto in general but what we do know from this fear and greed index meter is that whenever you buy in fear or preferably extreme fear it typically presents the best buying opportunity possible especially in a bull cycle i still believe that we're currently in a bull run and um, yeah as you can see 26 on the index so i would personally take this opportunity with both hands and don't get me wrong it will not get easy your emotions your ego will fight
fight you during this period because you get bombarded with negative news and bearish sentiment but you should understand that the best buying opportunities in crypto in general are when the market is fearful or in extreme fear and the best selling opportunities typically occur when the market is greedy or in extreme greed so i'm not saying that the bottom is right now necessarily in for crypto yes we can go slightly lower as i just explained but overall if you dca at the current prices and if you have a longer term vision let's say for the rest of 2024 or maybe even for 2025 as well then buying just me or any crypto at the current prices is a very good opportunity let's also have a brief look at bitcoin here on the weekly time frame and bitcoin is currently hovering around fifty four thousand dollars as you can see and i'm here on the weekly as i said so each candlestick is one week if we look at the ema ribbons here on the weekly chart for bitcoin then we can and let me actually enable them yeah here you can see that we're still trading within the ema ribbons here on the weekly chart which typically indicates that we're still in a significant uptrend whenever you trade below the ribbons especially for a few weeks it could trigger a more bearish trend a potential bear market but as of right now we're still trading on top of the ribbons uh, which is of course amazing to see here for bitcoin so yeah what is my worst case scenario personally guys to give you my honest opinion i I don't see bitcoin breaking below fifty thousand dollars can we go to 50k yes do i expect us to close a weekly candle below 50k no i don't think that there is high probability for such a thing to happen in the immediate short term yes we could drop a little bit lower as i said to the 50k area maybe to hover around that area or maybe a swift recovery back to the upside but i do not expect us to close a weekly candle below 50k to be very clear i still think that we're in an uptrend here this is just the last shakeout before new autumn highs for bitcoin and potentially a new massive altcoin season so yeah don't be fearful right now guys take this opportunity with both hands understand that whenever crypto is fearful whenever sentiment is bearish that is the time of opportunity and that was it guys for today's analysis on just me hopefully you found the video helpful if you did like the video of course and if you want to increase your profitability in this bull run then consider to join my trade signal group Group. I'm posting trades on a daily basis. I always provide my members with the exact entry of the trade, the stop loss to use, take profit levels, all of that good stuff. So if you're interested in that, definitely join. The official link is in the video description. Check it out. Thanks a lot for watching. I appreciate all the support. See you in the next Just Me video. Bye-bye.